most common pain complaint that we have are people who have spinal degeneration. So people that have neck and low back pain or limb pain from wear and tear of their spine um, and are in need of help. Everyone knows that arthritic conditions affect people more and more uh, as you get older and these same problems affect people as they age. So the incidence basically just rises with, with age. We take the time to really um, assess the patients and educate them about themselves and that helps them help us get them better. A minimalist approach is the best approach. So, but that doesn't mean that surgery is never indicated. Often patients don't want surgery and we try to keep them out of surgery by doing things that, um, you know, like physical therapy or injections or certain medications to try to help improve their quality of life, get their pain levels down and hopefully keep them out of the OR. But there are certain times when surgery is an appropriate option and so we're fortunate to have good neurosurgeons um, at the hospital here at Crozier who can take care of these patients. We always work as a team. So, you know, modifications are very common modifications that you'd expect to hear from. Weight loss can be one. Um, smoking cessation actually is one that I, I like to discuss with patients because the more you smoke, actually they activate uh, pain receptors. If you can um, work toward being as fit as possible and to being active, then that's the best prevention actually. Um, and being careful and not doing things that are beyond what you really should do, lifting very, very heavy things alone and not using good body mechanics. That's where people really get into trouble. We really utilize our staff, even our front office staff, but also our nurses for educating the patients and the physician's assistants and, and um, the different types of doctors. So we work as a team, we meet as a team, and we review the patients that are having the most difficulty and we try to make sure that we can put our expertise um, together so that we can brainstorm and give patients the best benefit.